This year is filled with all kinds of challenges, obstacles, failures, mishaps, setbacks, but it's also filled with all kinds of success. This is the year where we have the ability to become massive successful, but in order to attract that massive success, it's gonna take commitment, dedication, and consistency. Within every moment in life, there's a lesson. Life is trying to see if you're gonna understand the lesson and grow and improve, or are you gonna complain? You see, the reason why a lot of people don't get what they want in life is because they spend too much time complaining. As an individual, you can't grow by complaining all day. You cannot grow in life by viewing yourself as a victim. Everybody goes through things. Everybody has problems. You're not the only one. You can't continue to victimize yourself and ask the question, why me? Because everybody goes through things. Discipline is what separates the successful people from the unsuccessful people. You see, motivation is like gas in a car. You can only go so far with the amount of gas that you have in your car. You see, motivation ends. Motivation only has a temporary effect. Eventually, you're gonna become unmotivated. Eventually, you're not gonna to want to do the things that you need to do in order to be successful. And so what normal unsuccessful people do is that they give up, they procrastinate, they become lazy instead of pushing on. But you see what the successful people do is that they discipline themselves. There's a quote that says, when motivation ends, discipline begins. Successful people discipline themselves to do things even when they don't feel like it. Sometimes even when they're sick. Did you know that it's a lot of people on this earth that's not even happy? Given that it's so much to be grateful for, given that it's so much to be thankful for, given that we have so many opportunities, people are still not happy and people will find a way to not be happy. And maybe the person I'm talking to is you. Well, if you wanna be happy, you gotta recognize that happiness is a choice. It is your right to be happy. It is your responsibility to choose whether you be happy or not. The reason why a lot of people aren't happy in life is because they're focusing on the wrong stuff in life. They're always focusing on the negative things in life and what's not in their life. People will literally find ways to be sad. You know, it's easier to not be appreciative of what you don't have and what's available to you until it's gone. That one thing that's holding so many people back in life is fear. What are you afraid of? Why are you allowing it to hold you back? Why are you allowing it to prevent you from becoming the person that you know you want to become? Why are you allowing it to prevent you from gaining the things that you want out of life? Why are you allowing it to keep you boxed in, in a comfort zone, when you know you want so much more to life than what you have now? Why are you engaging in fear? Why are you letting it eat you inside, knowing that you want more to life? Why? You see, I've always said that it's normal to have fear, but you can't let fear have you. You can't allow fear to prevent you from becoming the person that you want to become in life. I've realized that we are engaged in the thought process when we're guessing, when we're wondering what's the worst thing that can happen. Why are you asking yourself that? By doing that, you're formulating ideas of all the possible scenarios of bad things that can happen in life. Why not engage in the thought process of what's the best thing that can happen in life if I chose to conquer my fears and go after what I want in life? Thank you.